With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. A ray of light is incident normally on one of the face of a prism of apex angle 30 degree. And refractive index of the prism is root 2. The angle of deviation of the ray in degree you have to find out. So let us draw a prism first. Here it is said that the angle of the prism, this angle is 30 degree. And it is also said that the ray incident normally on this face. So if it, it will uh, incident normally, then it will directly goes like this. So here the refraction will not take place, it will directly goes like this and this angle here is 90 degree and this angle is 60. So this angle will be 30 and after deviation let's say it goes like this. It, it will goes like this and if I draw a line continuing with it, so we know that this, this angle here is R. And this angle is 30. Right? If you see this angle is 30, then this angle will also be 30. And we want the angle of deviation. That will be R minus 30 degree. Right? So let's calculate the R. To calculate the R, we will use the Snell's law. So I will write from the Snell's law. We are applying the Snell's law at this point. right? So I will write here this uh, 1 mu of this is root 2. Right? Root 2 sin 30 is equals to mu of air is 1 sin r. So if I will write now if you see we got this r r is equals to 45 degree sin is 1 by root 2 at 45 degree. Now we can just put the value of r here you can see very clearly if you see this angle is uh, 45 and the angle it, it is 30. So this much is the angle through which it is deviated that is 45 minus 30. That is 15 degree. And now you can check for the option here C is the correct one. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.